Hi, Mike from Mike's Carburetor Parts here. <clears throat> I want to explain the idle and fast idle on a Mercarb. Somebody was asking me a question, so I thought I just thought I'd do a movie on it, or video, excuse me. Um, at idle, when the engine's hot, your <coughs> choke valve is open like this, and the cam, here's your idle screw, is it's on the low part of the cam, okay? So it's like that. Now when it's cold and your choke valve closes, you can see how it rides up the, the, the cam moves and opens up the uh, idle, idle screw a little bit, pushes it back. And what it'll do, it, it just opens the throttle just slightly. And that's what makes the idle faster. Okay. So this one, uh, I think all Mercarbs have the electric choke on it. Um, nope, the screw's gone. Okay, I had to go find a carburetor in the junk pile. Okay, so when you're setting the choke on these things, you hold your throttle open so it doesn't uh, um, keep the choke open or closed. And you turn it, and this has an index on it for marks, you can use that. But what I do is I turn it just until it closes, and then I give another eighth inch. Okay, I also feel there's got to be a little bit of pressure there. Okay, so that's the choke closed. Which it should be now because it's cold. Okay, so back to the fast idle. When it's warmed up, that's open, engine is at operating temperature, you adjust your idle. When, you're, uh, when it's cold in the morning, see how that moved? Okay, that's going to move your uh, it's going to put on the high side of the cam and it's going to make it idle a little faster. All right. So the only thing you set here is your idle when it's slow on the low part or idle when it's hot on the low part there. When it's, you don't reset anything when it's cold. Okay. It'll just automatically uh, idle quicker. So there's the cam once you get a real good look at it. There's your fast idle cam. Take a look at it to make sure uh, if you're having trouble with yours, make sure it's not on backwards. That would be easy to do. And remember when it's warm again, it's going to be on the low, low part down like that. Okay. And also look at your uh, rod. This one is of course your pump. That's got nothing to do with anything yet. Uh, this rod here, you make sure you don't have it in upside down. Okay. So that's how it's supposed to work. So I hope that helps. Uh, it helps answer the questions I get on the fast idle cam. Thank you for watching.